Hey guys, it's me, Mario. And today... We are continuing... The Great Dragon. <clears throat> to look at a dragon that lives in the icy plains. They're pretty huge. It's the Forever Right Forests. They're pretty huge. As you can see there, that little tiny spot right there is a Dragonian. They're pretty huge. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy the great dragon book so far. Let's do the four white force. <coughs> if you ever see a forest in the icy plains, it most likely is the back of this humongous dragon. To sleep, they bury themselves in ice, which allowed which allowed the huge amount of vegetation to grow on their back. They eat the plants on their back that they eat the plants that grow on them. These dragons eat twice their own body weight in a day and accomplish this by almost eating everything and other dragons and roots. They eat roots mostly because they're mostly underground. <laughs> but most of the time it's sleeping and are the only dragons to be awake in winter. To walk miles around Dragania, there are not many left because of their huge size and lack of food during winter, at least that's what we think. Perhaps it's because of the lack of food during winter, at least that's what the Draganians think. <clears throat> Their mating is unknown, so we have no idea where to start saving their kind. Plus, they're really hard to find. Sorry, that was a little jumbled of mess <laughs> reading, but you can probably piece it together, hopefully. I am... Um... I wasn't really thinking, um, you know, organizingly, whatever you call it. <laughs> so this is the Fire White Forest. A pretty cool dragon. One of the biggest in Dragania. Next up is the squid dragons. You could probably guess what they look like. 
The egg kind of gives it away if it will focus. Maybe it's too dark. It's probably too, too dark in here to realize the egg. These great dragon book ones go by really fast for some odd reason. <sighs> well, I hope you guys enjoy this dragon book so far. And I hope I will see you next one. Well, see ya.